Hey guys, it's Sorrow, and today's video is brand new and completely strange. 20 days, Sorrow, where have you been? I know, I'm losing my goddamn mind. Now, a couple of things before I even start this entire video, because the title is here, you're wondering what this is all about, but it's there. It's, it's there. I realized that my last previous, like, two videos have not been up to par to what exactly I do, but this has been kind of interesting for me. Now, for two things. One, I have looked everywhere on YouTube for the Pulse 3D uh, headset to kind of have a review on the PlayStation 5. Maybe I was just being too hasty. I was like, eh, maybe just not enough people have the PlayStation 5. I don't know. I was also looking for the V Moda Boom Pro mic and um, nothing. I just, I, I couldn't find anything. So I figured, why don't I do it my damn self? Now, one thing about this, I recorded four videos. One is in Astro's Playroom. One is in Terra because how could you not include Terra on a ceremony video? Godfall and Call of Duty Warzone. So essentially the whole idea is to kind of hear what the microphone sounds like inside the game. Now a lot of people use, you know, party mode or whatever. But before I continue, I want to say a special thanks to a few people. One is Johnny Gaming TV. I will leave his Discord in the description below if you guys are interested. Essentially, he has amazing coding skills. He creates Discord bots. He has hosting for you. So if you need Discord bots for moderation, music, emojis, reactions, DMs, stuff like that, he is a fantastic programmer and I definitely recommend him if you haven't gone there already. And the second thing is thank you to all of the people that have joined my Discord. There's over 5,000 people now, and um, I'm losing my mind. But let's get right into it. Now, I will preface all of this by starting with, I'm using the headphones, the One Audio Pro M50s, I believe they're called, with a V-Moda Boom Pro microphone, which a lot of people tend to use the Mod Mic, Mod Mic 5 or 4, because they're really, really good. And lastly, I decided to get the Creative Sound Blaster G3, which is a sound card that you can kind of uh, input on your PlayStation, and you can adjust the, it's kind of like an amplifier, but it makes things sound a little much better. It does have a mode there where you can actually click a button to hear better footsteps for games such as Call of Duty, I found that actually to interfere with the full audio system of the PlayStation 5 and made things actually sound worse. So I don't recommend clicking that button whatsoever, but the rest sounded really good. So I did mention a special thanks to all the people that have joined my Discord. Now, I didn't necessarily promote this. The reason this is happening, and it's not my fault, guys, I decided to basically develop a Discord bot that announces the PlayStation 5's stock in specific websites such as PlayStation Direct, GameStop, Walmart, Target, and pretty much a bunch of stores. And it will alert you automatically. Some news media actually got a hold of this information and started sharing it on various websites and people just keep coming in from articles and just hundreds of people every hour and I just don't know. Honestly, over 4,000 people have joined in the last five days, six days, and it's been, it's been rough. It's been hard to kind of figure out. It's, it's been quite the influx. It's been quite the influx, but welcome if you're watching this video and um, I hope you enjoy your stay. So I'm going to start this whole review by starting with Astro's Playground and then going into Terra and then finally going into Godfall with a final video of Call of Duty Warzone. Anyways, long winded, let's start. Hey guys, so I'm on Astro's Playroom. I'm just gonna press continue here. I've already beat the game. I've got the trophies, I've got everything. But I kinda wanted to hear how it sounds like while I'm talking. And I'm over here just talking and walking around. So you guys can kind of hear everything while there's lots of noise being made. Let's go to the GPU section because that song is fire if you haven't heard it already. Um, so I'm just talking and talking so you can kind of hear what it sounds like. A little bit of the mixing and see if that actually is something that sounds good. I have no idea how this sounds like because it's not in post uh, editing. So I have no idea whatsoever. So I'm hoping that it actually sounds good and I'm not making a fool of myself. Loki, this song is really good if you guys haven't heard. <laughs> so, you tell me, how does it sound on Astro's Playground? A lot of players use uh, their microphone in a game so they can speak with other players. So, let me know how this sounds like. And, um, hopefully, it's not too shabby. 
So we're going to switch over to another game and see what that sounds like on Terra. And then after that, we'll try on Godfall and just kind of see what that sounds like exactly. Now, if you're no stranger to Terra, you know that the game can be pretty damn loud. I haven't actually adjusted the microphone whatsoever to be louder or not. In fact, my settings are pretty much default. Um, but I'm just kind of hoping that this sounds okay. Right now, there's not that much noise. You can kind of hear the difference from now. This song is freaking loud. In fact, it's never been changed. I hope to God one day they'll just lower the music, um, especially for the previous menu. But... We're just going to go in, we're going to talk, and hopefully it sounds clear, because some games don't sound that clear. In fact, I had a raid on this just last Sunday, and apparently my microphone did not sound very clear for other players on the PlayStation 4, whereas on the PlayStation 5, it sounded just fine for me, um, at least after hearing it. So, let's hope this sounds okay while I'm inside the game, even though this is the full game anyway, so... So, testing, testing. This is Terra, and I'm Saramonin. I'm over here testing my mic and see how this sounds in game. Um, a lot of people have been wondering how exactly things sound on the PlayStation 5, so I'm hoping this kind of satisfies them. Let me know. And we're going to go and switch over to Godfall because, like I said, every mixing is different. Every game has different codecs, so it might affect every game differently of how you sound. So now we're on Godfall. Now, I haven't actually played this game whatsoever, and in fact, I was given access to the game by the developers of the game, and uh, thank you so much, it's actually sponsored, and I'm actually going to be doing a whole gameplay thing on it, either a video or a stream. You guys let me know what you guys want to see about it, but essentially, I just want to hear what my microphone sounds like here on Godfall, just while making random sounds, like charging my weapon, just hitting things. Now, I haven't even played the game whatsoever. I skipped all the cinematics and everything, so I wouldn't really hear anything or kind of spoil myself. So I have no idea what I'm doing. I'm just, like, hitting buttons right now. Um, so, yeah, I'm hoping this actually sounds not too shabby and that the microphone mixing is okay. Again, I haven't even messed with the settings whatsoever for the microphone, so uh, I have no idea how that's going to sound like. But, yeah, let's, uh, let's hope for the best here. Now, I think one of the biggest games in, well, Call of Duty history, or really any FPS history, is Call of Duty Warzone. And I'm not entirely sure how this sounds, because I don't actually use the microphone whatsoever in-game. But I know a lot of people do, either for whatever reasons they have. But I usually use Party Chat on the PlayStation 5. That's right. So I don't really know. But, um, yeah, I'm just kind of hearing how this sounds like. Now, this is the last video I'm going to make. Um, kind of creating content around it. So I know a lot of people are going to be asking, why do you sound so nasally? What's going on? Are you sick, bro? Uh, honestly, it's 5.45 in the morning. I have not slept whatsoever. <laughs> um, and basically, I've barely slept for the last 20 days trying to get thousands of people, PlayStation 5s. Right. And I'm pretty rest. sure that I mentioned why. Um, so yeah, I hope this actually sounds not too sh- so I realized that I was just rambling on and just saying a lot of sounds, essentially. Not even words at that point. Sometimes I was just kind of rambling on. Kind of like I am right now. Um, but basically, I just kind of want to create a lot of words and, you know, see what that sounded like. Lots of S's, lots of T's, lots of P's, and just kind of see what that was like. I did record a voice message to myself on an alternate account just to kind of see what that would sound like on a PlayStation Party because the quality is exactly the same from sending a voice message to the PlayStation Party. So this is actually how it would sound like by sending yourself a PlayStation message. Hey you, which is me, um, I'm just sending you a message so you can kind of hear what it sounds like with a party or sending a message on the voice memo thing that you can do on the game base on the PlayStation 5. So you can tell it's relatively warmer, it's actually a little bit more different and the mixing is definitely uh, different. But honestly, I'm very, 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 very happy with the Vmoda mic. It's actually been super good. I did not think it would be this good. I thought, damn it, I'm gonna have to return another Amazon purchase. I have returned like four microphones in one month because nothing was working and yes i did have the pulse 3d and yes i did return it and i had a whole video about that and 
I don't know what to tell you. I didn't like the microphone. The sound quality was good, but the microphone wasn't good. And I know in the previous video, there was a lot of messages like, oh, my friends told me that I sound fantastic. Well, I would hate to hear you sound on a crappy mic then, because it sounds bad. I don't know what to tell you. It sounds amazing when you're actually hearing things, but when you're actually talking to the mic, it's better if you just shut up. Now, I did mention that I was using the Bankio CM9000, I believe it's what it's called. I actually put it away. Um, and it does sound really good. Unfortunately, that quality sacrifices some things. And one of those things is the Tempest 3D engine. You don't get to hear it as clearly and as powerfully. And the reason I actually like the microphone is because it actually already has a sound card. And it's cheap. But this system altogether that I've put up, a lot of people would tell you to use the V Moda mic, either with the Philips SHP 9500 or by using a Sennheiser or something like that, which you could um, if you really want to go out there. A lot of people are spending money on headsets that cost $500 and this costs not nearly as much as that. It costs $143 altogether, let's say $145, even though it's pretty much the same cost, maybe $10 to $20 difference in taxes, it still sounds better. I 100% recommend you use headphones, always. The reason for this is that a lot of companies create headphones that aren't headphones, they're, they're headsets. It's a gaming headset that you use that are over expensive for no reason whatsoever and it doesn't even give you the best quality. Yes, you get a nice mixer sometimes, yes the amplifier is fantastic sometimes and you can actually hear really good quality, but the reality of it is you're going to get a better quality from companies that actually use this for studio stuff like microphones or music stuff. So Sennheiser, Philips, Sony, Audio-Technica, you're going to get all of these companies that actually sound fantastic. One Audio is actually one of the biggest things right now in the last couple years because they're cheap, but they use really, really fantastic quality products and it doesn't feel cheap. It works, it's comfortable, and it sounds like a $300 headphone. So that aside, the microphone itself is fantastic for me. I honestly probably would have gone with the Mod Mic 5 simply because it's a bit more warmer and it's actually cleaner and crisper for me. It's not really a normal occurrence for me to always be on voice chat, but it's important that when I do, that I actually sound crisp, clear, and that, well, I don't sound like a muffled crazy man. And of course, that I can actually hear the game how it's supposed to be played. Now, eventually I'll probably upgrade my headphones to something like Sennheiser or Philips, because those two companies are absolutely fantastic and they create amazing products that you'll honestly hear the difference. But for now, I think uh, One Audio definitely has the one up. Um, definitely wasn't meaning to do a pun there. But the One Audio 50 definitely I'm very, very happy with. And I think I found my headphones. I'm not, I haven't complained whatsoever. I've been very happy with the microphone quality. It's all connected via USB, luckily. So it's not connected to my controller. It's not wasting the battery life, luckily, because the haptics already <laughs> waste so much battery. Oh my goodness. So yeah. That is my little review on this. I feel like I rambled on for too long, and I hope that actually was maybe a little helpful. Thanks for watching, guys. Make sure to subscribe and click the adorable f***ing bell to know when I upload a brand new video. And don't forget to come join my Discord if you want to chat and hang out. Much love and as always, till next time, friends.